Hello everyone! Welcome sa ating second solve problem sa elimination of arbitrary constants. We have to find the differential equation whose solution is given by xy squared minus 1 is equal to cy. Again, meron tayong solution. Kailangan natin hanapin yung de by removing yung arbitrary constant natin in this case, c. Most of the time, kung ilan yung arbitrary constants natin, ganun yung bilang na pagkuha natin ng derivative. In this case, we only have one arbitrary constant, kaya isang beses tayo kukuha ng derivative. Getting the derivative with respect to x nung given natin na solution, we are given here, kung mapapansin nyo, we have two variables here, we have x and we have y squared. So, to solve for its derivative, we have to apply product rule of differentiation. Doing product rule of differentiation, ang gagawin natin is we copy the first and then imumultiply natin siya dun sa derivative ng ating second term. In this case, y squared. Applying power rule of differentiation, ang gagawin natin is copy si x, ibababa natin si 2, and then babawasan natin siya ng isa. So, this will become 2y. And we are getting the derivative with respect to x and ang kinuha na natin ng derivative is y, kaya kailangan natin ng dy over dx. To visualize that, here, copy the first, ibaba si 2, eto si 2, and then y, 2 minus 1 is just 1, kaya ito ay naging y lang. So, x times 2y, and then we have to get dy over dx. That is for the first part ng product rule. Second part ng product rule of differentiation plus, we copy the second, y squared, and then we get the derivative of our first term, which is x. We are getting the derivative with respect to x, kaya diretsyo na lang tayo. Derivative of x is just 1, kaya ang natira na lang ay si y squared. And then, dito sa ating right side, so constant c, derivative of y is just 1, and then 1 times dy over dx, kasi we are getting its derivative with respect to x. Now that we are finished with our product rule of differentiation, the rest algebra na lang to. To simplify, let us multiply this part and then let us multiply yung buong equation kay dx para mas masimplify natin siya. Doing that simultaneously, so we have 2xy and then yung dx sa denominator ay mawawala na. So this will become 2xy na tira si dy and then y squared times dx is equal to, dito sa part na to, dx over dx is just 1 kaya ang natira ay si dy na lang din. So, that's it for this one. Now, nakakuha na tayo ng equation na pwede natin pagkuhanan para ma-eliminate natin yung arbitrary constant natin na C. So, we will be going back with our given solution, xy squared minus 1 is equal to cy. Ang gagawin natin is we have to solve for the value of C. To do that, we have to multiply the equation by 1 over y para ma-isolate natin na ang matitira na lang ay si C. This will become xy squared minus 1 over y is equal to c. Dahil meron na tayong value ng c, isasubstitute na natin siya dito sa nakuha natin na first derivative dito. Doing the substitution, it will become 2xy dy plus y squared dx, itong part na to, is equal to yung c natin, which is xy squared minus 1 all over y, it will be substituted dun sa value ng c, diretsyo na siya dito, and then, this will become dy. Ngayong tapos na tayo dun sa substitution process, simplification na lang tayo. To simplify this equation, let us multiply both sides of the equation by y para mawala na tayo ng ating denominator. So, ang mangyari, this will become 2xy times y, this will become y squared, 2xy squared dy, plus yung y squared ay naging y cubed dx. Dito sa part na to, y times 1 over y, mawawala na siya, kaya ang matitira na lang ay si xy squared minus 1 dy. Then, pagsamasamahin natin yung merong dx at merong dy. So, solo lang naman si dx, okay na siya. What I will be doing ay ililipat ko etong part na to sa kabila. So, this will become una si y cubed dx. As a practice, nasasanay lang ako na inuna ko si dx. And then, we have 2xy squared dy 
Tapos, this will become negative xy squared minus 1 dy. Next, kailangan kong i-factor out si dy. Anong matitira sa loob, this will become 2xy squared and then, paalala lang, ang nakasubtract ay yung buong terms na to. Kaya this will become negative xy squared at etong part na to will become positive 1. Kaya anong nangyari, retain si 2xy squared minus xy squared and then eto ay naging positive 1 kasi ang nakasubtract ay etong buong terms na to. Then to simplify, pareho lang sila na xy squared so we can subtract. 2xy squared minus xy squared is just equal to positive 1 xy squared. Kaya we have our final answer of y cubed dx plus xy squared plus 1 dy is equal to 0. This is our final answer na wala na si arbitrary constant natin na C. This means that this differential equation, isa sa kanyang solution ay si xy squared minus 1 is equal to cy. Music